Hey Minglings, it's Friday. It's like 5 in the morning and I woke up and I couldn't go back to sleep and I have a super busy day today so my choices were going to either be film right now or film never. Yesterday my friend Viv started moving in and that's really exciting because my previous roommate and I really weren't friends. Like we got along okay. We didn't really have any arguments, we didn't really have any problems with each other, but it just wasn't really a friendly environment, like we just really didn't talk to each other. We would come into the room and say hey, and then we would leave and say bye, and my friends thought it was weird that I didn't even know where she was, like she never said I'm going to the library, bye. It wasn't any of that, like I literally had no idea. She could have been at class, she could have been in her friend's room, she could have been in the library. It was all the same to me. Being in that environment is kind of weird because you're sitting so close to someone all the time, but you aren't being social with them whatsoever. I had a hard time imagining her complexly though because we never talked and I really don't think she understood me at all. She's nice, it wasn't like there was a problem, but it will be kind of fun living with my friend. She's slowly moving in and so this is probably the first and last time I will be able to make a video at 5 in the morning because I'll have a roommate that I won't be able to wake up. Next week is spring break and I'm going to be traveling on the Friday and I also have class and work on that Friday so I really don't think I'll be able to make a video so I was wondering if anyone would like to sub for me. Um, this could be a viewer. I think that would be super cool um, because this is a time when I know I can't make it and I know people have an interest in subbing. It's always cool to get a fresh face on the channel and we don't do enough guests, I think. So if somebody who is a viewer would like to sub for me, please leave me a comment and we can figure out how to make that work. I'm very excited to be going home for spring break, although the reason I have to go home is a lot of doctor's appointments and um, I have to take like a CPR class and I possibly have an interview. So. It's like, I'm not going home for fun, really. I probably wouldn't be going home if I didn't have so many doctor's appointments to go to. It'll be really nice to be home again, although I really feel like I was just there. And I kind of was. It was like, what, six weeks ago? At the end of the year, my family and I are going straight to Spain and Portugal for like three or four weeks. And so I won't be able to come home again until June, I think. So it'll be nice to be able to go home and have kind of my time at home before all of that. I'm gonna go edit this before the craziness of the day sets in. I have so much to do. Oh my god, never go to college. Just kidding, go to college. Or don't, really. It's not for everyone, but do whatever you want. Don't let me tell you what to do. That's the moral of this week. Except let me convince you to sub for me next week. I started to say I'll see you all next week, but I really won't. So hopefully someone will see you next week in my place. And Zach, I will see you tomorrow.